And it doesn't matter how big or small your act of kindness is. It matters how you impacted that person's day and what you're gonna do in the future. It could be a small conversation, an elbow bump, anything that can make us more united as a whole. Unity doesn't just mean that you're a bullying or cyberbullying preventer. It means that you're trying your best to make a more inclusive and loving community where we can all be ourselves. You need to be that child's role model all the time. So that child has somewhere to look up to and somewhere to go when needed. You really need buy-in. You need to train your staff. Everyone at your organization needs to really be behind the movement. To make lasting impact, you need your entire team on board. Role model for the youth that you work with. Have complete buy-in from your staff and you really can change the world. I will first thank them so much for wanting to touch lives, for this is so important. Then I will give her or him the names of active groups in the community, in the churches, the school, and in the community organization, and encourage them to join with them. So many voices are out there in the community saying no to bullying, and they will be more than glad to receive the help. As they say in my home country of Haiti, many hands makes the load much lighter. I would say for the child to go to their school and they will, and and like um, tell like teach other kids about bullying and how bad it is and and spread that um, part of the bullying and so we can end bullying once and for all. To remember that it's not all uh, large-scale things or speaking a lot of it you know really comes down to everyday actions and behaviors and environments so obviously if you see someone being bullied you should try to stop it and do what you can educate yourself on all the many types of bullying there is so when we're talking about bullying prevention, some things that you can do to be an upset in your community is spread kindness. Do, 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 do. Class, today we're going to talk about building and maintaining relationships. The question of the day is, why is it important to be kind to one another? Ooh, ooh, right here, me, me. Bentley? Being kind to one another is important because we all deserve to be treated with respect, kindness, and care. Treating others with kindness builds healthy relationships with our family, peers, and friends. One way to show kindness is sending a kindness ninja card digitally. We are all capable of being kind. Uh, one way to stop uh, bullying in our school is to just respect others based on what they believe in. Respect the others for their beliefs. 